you for short information, Nick. Question number two, Kira Tavarella. The Speaker, uh, my question is to the Minister of Finance. What progress, if any, has been made on implementing the government's economic policies? Mr Speaker. The Honourable Grant oh, I Robinson. Can, I can do it. Good. Mr Speaker, considerable progress. Uh, yesterday I talked about the changes we have made to the legislative framework that supports our economic policies and plan. Today I want to focus on the work we have done to help businesses and workers prepare for the changing nature of work as we transition to a new economy that is more productive, sustainable and inclusive. The transition to a new economy represents massive opportunities and challenges. The government has set a clear goal of a net zero carbon economy by 2050 and, importantly, a just and deliberate transition to that goal that supports communities, industries and workers through that transition. What specific policies has the government progressed to support this transition? Speaker, just a few examples. Uh, the Future of Work Tripartite Forum, which brings businesses, workers and government together to advance policies in four key areas, just transitions, learning for life, technology and workplace productivity. We have the Mana and Mahi programme, which is providing financial support to employers to fill the skill gaps by supporting the cost of apprenticeships for young New Zealanders who have been on the benefit for six months or more, and our fees-free scheme, which provides opportunity for post-secondary school education and training, including two years free for trades training and apprenticeship schemes. Supplementary, yeah, yeah. What specific outcomes have come from the Future of Work Tripartite Forum? Mr Speaker, the Forum has developed a skills shift initiative in the manufacturing sector alongside Manufacturing New Zealand. This brings together employers, industry training organisations, unions and training providers to plan the workforce training needs for this important sector for the next two decades. It's this kind of forward planning that is essential if New Zealanders are to have a fair and just transition to a world of work that has been rapidly changed by new technology. Question number three, the Honourable Amy Adams. My question is to the Minister of 